Okay, we're here with Chuck from AFL. And uh, Chuck, uh, you're going to give us a demo of the Fujikora uh, 21S. The 21S, this is an active cladding alignment core uh, fusion machine. Brand new on the market. We're releasing it publicly for the first time here at Bixie. Happy to be doing that. And uh, we'll step through a demo right quick. Okay. Okay. The uh, operation of the machine is very much like the other Fujikura machines. Uh, very similar to the uh, 12S, the Beagle machine, and even similar to the uh, to the core line machine in, uh, in how you interface with the device. So uh, to do a splice, it's the same process that we're all uh, so intimately familiar with. You want to strip your uh, colorant off of your box. Okay. You always want to clean it with alcohol. This is 250 micron single mode fiber. We're cleaning. And you want to give it a good cleave. Okay. With 250 micron fiber, you can cleave it pretty short. We're going to cleave this one at 12 millimeters. Inside the 21S, we do have a sheath clamp system. Okay. So many that are uh, familiar with our uh, core alignment machine and some of our uh, Higher end Vigor machines will appreciate the, uh, the sheath clamps as opposed to the fiber holder system alone. Although the 21S is compliant with the fiber holder system, there's one uh, one small set screw right here that you back out, sheath clamp lips out, and you're off to the races with your fiber holders. One of the advantages of the 21S machine is it is an active cladding alignment machine. So it is uh, physically looking at the cladding, the 125 micron uh, section of the fiber, actively aligning that on the two fibers together. Um, using modern fiber and uh, for connectors and splice on connectors and that kind of thing, um, we believe this is going to be a uh, be a real good machine. All right, so we're loaded up. As you can see, it's a pretty automated process. We simply loaded the fibers in and shut the wind protector, and it's off to the races. Pretty good loss. <laughs> yeah. So here it's going to do a proof test and pull back against the splice to make sure that we uh, we don't have any bubbles in there or anything like that. If it's going to break, this is the time we want it to break, not when it's in the tray or in the sleeve or anywhere else. <laughs> this up and off the table here. Slide the sleeve over the splice. Always want to try to center it. Right. Now she's shrinking. It's about a 30 second operation on the, uh, on the tube here. So comparing it to the uh, to the 12S, you have a similar battery life. So you got a similar uh, similar design to the machine. The interface is the same. Um, little different uh, pricing structure here. You're looking uh, around three thousand dollars list price on the uh, fixed feed group 12S machine. You're looking around seven on the 21S. Okay. Add a little bit if you want it with a kit and a cleaver. Okay, but uh, some of the things the 21S will do that the uh, that'll help you along above the traditional fixed V group machine is it'll overcome some of the hygiene issues. It's got. There's your fusion splice. Yeah. Just about like we'd like it. Um, the uh, V groove maintenance is not as key as it is in the 12S, uh, and it's an active uh, aligning process in the machine. So. Good demo. What Thanks, Chuck.